Our KPRC2 investigates team is on the trail of a Cypress man accused of impersonating a doctor. And it's not the first time he's been hit with these sorts of allegations. The surgery center is located off Still Meadow Drive and Lost Meadow Drive off the Katy Freeway. And that is where we find KPRC2 investigator Joel Eisenbaum. Joel, what have you been able to uncover so far? Well, here's what we got, Keith, and just to expand on that, uh, where we are exactly, it is just off the Katy Freeway, and we're right near North Kirkwood. And you see that big giant building right behind me, the atrium-style building? Inside of it is a place called the Houston Aesthetic Center. It's a day surgery center where you can get breast augmentation, you can get liposuction, you can get injections of Botox, but HPD and the Texas Medical Board have a problem with at least one of their employees. In a well-to-do section of a master-planned community in Cyprus, we wanted to talk to a man who police say has been pretending to be a state-licensed doctor. And 53-year-old Alexander Padilla is charged with just that felony. Padilla has been in trouble before. In 2013, the Texas Medical Board ordered him to cease and desist from practicing unlicensed medicine. That's after he was accused of performing liposuction. Friday, we didn't find Padilla. We found his wife. Do you want to say anything or do you want to think and call me? Or... No, this is my husband, definitely. I, I won't say anything for sure. You will not say anything for sure? No, I, I don't okay. because he's his case. That criminal case included inspecting a topless female patient. Quote, the defendant told the confidential informant he would perform the breast augmentation surgery himself. End quote. Unfortunately, according to court docs, that particular patient was an undercover cop. Padilla was arrested on the spot, but has posted a $10,000 bond. So Alexander Padilla's wife says that he, no. He wasn't home. Right. We asked if he was at work. Yes. She didn't say, so we're going to find out. That's very good. Well, you should just be the reporter. Houston Aesthetic Center's website is still functioning, and Padilla's pick is still on it. It does not say he is a doctor. The state says he does not hold a doctor's license or a surgical assistant's license in Texas. I talked to somebody on the phone yesterday. They were open. Their hours say Monday through Friday, 9 to 5. Uh, but they're not here and we saw people leaving. I don't know if they were from this office, but this place is locked up like a drum when they're open nine to five. They say they're gonna and so I think that's a big question tonight. Is the aesthetic center, Houston Aesthetic Center open? Are they gonna see patients in the future? You can bet we'll keep tabs on that part of the story. We're live in West Houston tonight. I'm Joel Eisenbaum, KPRC 2 News.